don't have the composition of the teams. I'm not too sure. Yeah, they're actually in this race, lane seven, and it seems to be vacant. Uh, so don't forget the record uh, set in 2014 by Jamaica. It's the four by 400 meters really for the under 18 girls. This time they're up and running. And uh, we're gonna see who's gonna be making up the start of very early. It's the four by 400 meters. In lane two is Grenada, lane three Bahamas, lane four Jamaica, lane five Tux and Caicos. The BVI is in lane six. And the Guyana should have been in lane seven. St. Vincent and the Grenadines, lane eight. Very early to call this one, but we can see Jamaica making up some stagger here on the British Virgin Islands. The Tucks and Caicos as well. And then we have the Bahamas on the inside looking good, and that should be Brittany Fountain of the Bahamas. The Jamaica leads in the first leg of the 4x400 four meters. But not a big lead though. Uh, because the Tucks and Caicos is right up there with them in lane five. They're going to come up for the first handover now, the first change changeover. In the girls, 4 by 400 meters on the 18. Jamaica still with a slender lead over the Bahamas. It looks as Denaya Freeman of the Bahamas and Stacey and Williams for Jamaica. But it looks like Williams here for Jamaica over Freeman of the Bahamas as they make inwards now to the inside lane. Uh, Jamaica continues to lead over the Bahamas, then we have the Tucks and Caicos, and then there is the BVI. St. Vincent and the Grenadines is up there, Trinidad is in there as well, but Jamaica, one, Bahamas two so far. And I make it Tucks and Caicos in three at the moment. And this is where Jamaica will just extend that lead as much as possible going into the third leg. So it's Jamaica making that second and over first. Then it's the Bahamas, and it looks as though it's the BVI in third year now. Then St. Vincent and the Grenadines running good here. Jerry George, you must be happy to see St. Vincent and the Grenadines being featured, at least in fourth position in the 4x400 four meters. But Jamaica continues to extend the lead over the Bahamas on so the third leg here. And it looks as though it's Shalik Walker for Jamaica over uh, uh, Gabriel Gibson of the Bahamas. Shalik Walker. And I'm sure she would look to extend the lead that Jamaica already has over the Bahamas. The BVI should be in third, but Jamaica in the likes of Walker, Shanique Walker over Gibson of the Bahamas. And the BVI and St. Vincent and the Grenadines in third and fourth, respectively. But this is a good run by Gibson. I think she is keeping up very well here. The final handover here now. Jamaica in the lead. And... Uh, for Jamaica, this should be Chrisani May, the Bahamas, Megan Moss. Chrisani May with a commanding lead in this 4x400 meter event. Jamaica continues to dominate the relay events here at Carrick 2016. And they haven't gone to catch her. I don't think they want Stevenson. No, she looks absolutely pretty much not. well composed up front. Pacing her race nicely. The Bahamas is second. BVI in third. St. Vincent is giving a spirited performance here as well but it's Jamaica uh, Jamaica with a nice lead here with just about 150 to go just about 100 now it is Jamaica over the BVI by maybe I make it some 30 meters or so and she's pouring down she's sprinting for all that she's got she's not gonna just go through the tape here she's going for the record as well uh, Jamaica is going to win this one comfortable the flash time 3 39 20 what a run here by Jamaica. Bahamas in second. It's going to be the BVI in third. Uh, let's see who comes in fourth here now. It's Trinidad and Tobago, then Grenada, and then St. Vincent fading somewhat in the distance. But they're running third for most of it, St. Vincent. Jerry George seems to be a little bit confused. They were actually fourth for most of the race. St. Vincent and the is fading towards the end. Three. But a good run here by Jamaica, Stevenson. Very much. 3.39, well outside the Carifta record, which is 3.37.65, set in 2014. But a spirited run. And I would think that from beginning to end, these four girls, these four queens, they really pushed 
pushed everything that they had and Jamaica came home successfully. It's not surprising at all. We, we thought that they will come home with it and they did it and did it in convincing manner. Well, that's the quartet of sprinters there for Jamaica. We see now Kasani May bringing up the victory here for Jamaica and she was not easing up at all over the other contenders in this event. She May really pushed towards the finish line. May was really, really relentless. You know, when you know that you're in charge, sometimes you could just ease it up a bit. This was not the case. She came home and came home very strong. Jamaica, they get gold. With a flash time of 3.39.20, they came in with a best time here of 3.39.13. The quartet of Shanoi Powell, Stacey and William Shanoi. So it's live track and field action, Carrifter Games 2016.